and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be lip obsessed package prepping with you guys. I have been getting so many requests to film this video and I thought that now would be a great time to do this because the holiday season is in full swing and so are lip obsessed orders. Girl, let me tell you, I have literally been getting new orders in about every 15 to 20 minutes. It is insanity in the best way possible. So I spend about six hours every other day package prepping. Um, like literally I'm hunched over watching Fuller House as I package prep. It is a lot of fun, but it is a lot of work. So I'm going to show you guys how I do it. And before I continue talking about this, in case you guys are new here and you don't know what I'm talking about, I run my own lip balm business called Lipsest. I launched my brand around three years ago and yeah, this is the busiest time of year for me and I always get tons of questions about my package prepping process. Wow, lots of alliteration in that sentence. But anyways guys, without further ado, we are just going to get straight into this video and I hope you guys will find this interesting or entertaining or both. Okay, so right next to me, I have this pretty little pink bench, but did you know that it opens up and inside is all of my lip obsessed package prepping supplies? Well, now you know, in case you didn't. It needs to be organized. It's kind of a mess right now, but just to give you a little rundown of what's inside of here, I've got mini bubble mailers for my smaller orders. I've got these jumbo bubble mailers for really big orders. Um, I have these white ones right here, and these are like medium size. I have confetti in this box. I've got various different kinds, Halloween, Valentine's Day, Christmas, so on and so on. In here we have, ooh, what do you know, a new order. Did you guys hear that cha-ching? In this box we have some Christmas star confetti. We've got lip obsessed business cards. We've got the literally lip obsessed stickers. Um, what else? Of course, I can't forget to mention paper worms. This bag has pink and purple paper worms. Then we have the holiday assortment. For extras, I have a bag of candy. I have an entire bag devoted to stickers. And I have tons of different types in here, just depending on the time of year. Um, we also have these little baggies right here. I will take one out and show you what they look like. Yeah, this is what I usually put the lip obsessed collections in when people order. Yeah, that's just like a little overview of what's inside of this thing. But the package that we are going to be prepping today is the entire lip obsessed collection. So this is one of each of every currently available flavor. And you guys could find this on my eBay or Etsy shop in case you wanted it for Christmas. It is the biggest order that you could possibly place and it's pretty awesome. I'm assuming that this was probably ordered as a Christmas gift. So we need to make sure it is perfect. All right guys, so please excuse the lighting. It's like about to be golden hour, or actually it is golden hour. Um, but anyway, so I just went through and I counted all of the lip balms to make sure that we had the right amount. And also just to ensure that there were no duplicates because when you order the entire collection, you get no duplicates. That's the best part. So since everything looks good, I am going to be putting them into this plastic bag and then we are going to wrap it like a Christmas present to make it more special. So as I put each flavor in the bag, I'm going to tell you what the name is just because why not? I think it'll be fun. All right, so first we have Vampire Blood Scary Black Cherry and obviously this one was for Halloween. Um, another Halloween one. This is Monster Mash Ice Cream Cake. Hot Mess Express Extra Espresso from the Star Fam Starter Pack set. OMG Girl Literally Lemonade, also from the Star Fam Pack. Fresh Corn Bread, literally these are just so random. Like we go from OMG Girl Literally Lemonade to Fresh Corn Bread. Um, that was part of a Thanksgiving collection, by the way. Cheerful Cheerleader Pom Pom Pomegranate from Halloween. No Budget Banana Cake Pop from the Star Fam Collection. It's the Bomb.com Slayberry Shortcake instead of Strawberry Shortcake. Um, Gingerbread House, Zombie Zone Bubblegum Brains. Into the bag they go. Banana Split Sunday, Root Beer Fizz, Target Parking Lot White Cherry Slushy. Another very iconic flavor. Circus Clown Cotton Candy. Demonic Devil Dark Chocolate. Yeah, there's a lot of Halloween ones in this order. 
but it's one of everything, so they are included. Blue Raz Burst. Oh, I love blue raspberry flavored anything. Fuzzy Pink Wheel, Pinkalicious Frosting from the Starfam Collection. Choco Chip Cookie, PB&J Perfection, Wicked Witch Purple Potion Punch, Pumpkin Pie, mm, I wish I could eat that right now actually, Sugar Cookie Cutouts, our Pirate Bubblegum Gold, Spooky Skeletons Candy Corn. By the way guys, I want you to let me know out of all the flavors that I'm naming, what would be your top three? Yeah, I know, I make my threes very weird. Yeah, make sure you're paying attention to the flavors because I wanna hear your list of top three faves. All right, this is Elfie Eggnog Spice, Ghastly Ghost Boo Raspberry, Hashtag PJ Party Pizza Pie from the Sleepover Collection, Red Velvet Cookie, Mouse Mary Mallow, Penguin Peppermint Patty, Cranberry Sauce, Reindeer Ribbon Candy, Gleaming Gumball, Birthday Kick Bash, my favorite and yours, if you've tried it before. I'm sure it is one of your favorite lip sets, because girl, I love birthday cake flavored anything. I heard that they have birthday cake seasoning out there and I still need to get it. Anyway, we have Chipmunk Chai Latte, Police Officer Donuts and Coffee, Unicorn Kisses, Perfect Pink Lemonade, Bumblebee Honey Pot, Fairy Princess Pink Pastry, a lot of those were Halloween flavors, so exciting. So in this pile of 10, we have Angelic Angel Sweethearts, Black Spider, ah, Apple Cider, Blueberry Muffin Bliss, Cupcake Sweet Shop, Jolly Jelly Cookie, and this is like one of my favorites right now, Cardinal Cranberry Cuddles, Polar Bear Berry Freeze, Gingerbread cookie, brown sugar and carrots, and then lastly, gummy bear obsessed. So let's just make sure these are nice and neatly put in the bag because we're gonna be wrapping it. Here is the bag of Lipsessed, and I just love the way this looks like all the rainbow caps. It's just so satisfying. I'm so excited for this person. Um, so, okay, what we are going to do now is we are going to wrap it, okay? So I have some red tissue paper that I'm going to use. Let me angle myself. Okay, we are going to need some tape. I'm not like a professional wrapper or anything, but I try my best to make it look pretty. This is like a little gift factory. I'm like an elf. Boom, and then, yes! Oh, they're gonna be so excited to open this on Christmas Day. I can't wait. I mean, I don't know if they ordered this for Christmas or not, but I'm just kind of guessing. So, as for envelope size, I think that this is probably gonna be too small. Oh yeah, not a chance. I'm not even gonna try putting that in there. So, we are going to use this big whopper of a package. Let's put it inside. I mean, I probably could've used something a little bit smaller than this, but you know what? That's okay. So, you could always like fold it over like this, you see? And it won't be so bad. All right, um, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to get the extra things ready. So that includes a business card and sometimes even a literally lip cessed sticker. Okay, so in this case, I am going to be giving them a sticker because this is a very big order. I have little mini paper clips in here. So I'm going to give them a red one since it's like Christmassy color. So let's connect that. All right, yay. So we're going to put this inside of the package and now we need some paper worms and some candy, okay? So how about we get the candy first? Let's see, oh my gosh, there is so much good stuff in here. I think I'm going to give them a red and a green lollipop, okay? I have mini candy canes in there too and peppermints, but I think this would be fun to receive. So we're gonna put that in the package as well. And now we need a bunch of Christmas paper worms, guys. So I'm just gonna take a handful. Whoa, baby. I'm just gonna put that in there. So okay, let's give them three erasers. I'm going to give them this little holiday wreath, this little polar bear, and then we also have a little elf. 
And now we are going to seal this. Of course, I'm going to put a postage label on it as well, but I don't want to do that on camera just because I don't want to expose any addresses. So I'm going to take off this little seal and we are going to just like bend this in half. There we go. Perfect. Yes. See, it doesn't look quite as obnoxiously huge now. All right, we made it work. So the shipping label is going to be right here. But again, I'm not doing that on camera just for the safety of this person who ordered. So now for stickers. I go through stickers so quickly, guys. Um, but all of these little sticker sheets that you see right here, I found them at Target and each one was only a dollar. So it's pretty awesome. But I love these right here. They're little holiday stickers with different sayings on it. Like there's Holly and Jolly, ba la 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 la, on the nice list, and so on and so on. So I'm just gonna go crazy with the stickers, all right? <gasps> Ooh, we gotta put Santa Claus on there. Here comes Santa Claus, here comes Santa Claus, right down Santa Claus Lane. Okay, there we go. So we have our stickers on there. And the very last thing I would need to do is just stick the postage label on the front and then this thing is ready to go out. But anyways, now you guys have a little idea of what goes into prepping each and every lip test order that I get in. Um, I just wanted to say thank you so, so, so much to everybody who has supported my brand Lip Cest, especially over the holidays. I know there are so many options for gifts and I just wanted to say thank you, thank you, thank you times a million and 10 for choosing mine. Also, did you guys notice I was wearing my literally Lip Cest shirt? I don't think I mentioned that yet. So I just wanted to tell you, I mean, <laughs> It's kind of insignificant but it's kind of not because I wore it purposely for this video. If you guys would like to check out my lip set lip balms and order some for the holidays then the link to my eBay and Etsy shop will be in the description box below. But I love you all so so much. Thank you for watching and I will talk to you soon. Bye! Mwah.